What's up all you cool kids? This is Daisy Collins of TsunamiRose.net. Coming at you live from my craft room here in Las Vegas, Nevada. As I do um, bring you content. <laughs> I wanted to say my day to Friday, but I've been skipping days here and there. Anyways, bring you junk journal content and videos. So if that's what you're into, please do subscribe and give me a little thumbs up on this video. It would really, really help me out. Um, if you are in the market for pair journal printables, you can check out my shop. I would appreciate your support. Um, pretty much everything here that I'm working with is from my store. It's a printable of sorts for my shop. I also um, have a print service if you're interested. And yeah, that's what we're doing today. I am continuing on decoration of this prayer journal. I apologize, I didn't come on live last night. I really have to stop saying I'm gonna take a nap at eight o'clock and then next thing I know it's midnight. Like, <laughs> my bad, my bad, it happened to me. <laughs> I said it's 8 o'clock, I'm taking a nap, I'll wake up at 9.30, go live, and then next thing I know, it's midnight. <laughs> so, sorry about that. But, we are live now, I need to get this last signature done, and then I can work on getting the pockets and stuff stuffed with something, something or another. I want to put something right here. I guess this one here that says blessed. It's kind of cute. It's kind of cute under the little birds. What's up, Ms. Zena? What's going on, girlfriend? And then I designed some new envelopes. So I'm working on listing those tonight. They are so beautiful. I'm so excited. What's going on, Ms. Zena? How's work been? I see you doing some fabulous gigs. She goes to all the pretty places. You got your nose pierced. Oh my. I'm such a baby. I'm done with all that stuff. <laughs> I'm so done with all the um electoral pain. <laughs> I'm just not in the mood for any of that. <laughs> yeah, busy can't complain. That's great, girl. I'm happy for you. How uh did does your nose still hurt? <laughs> I just always thought I can't get my nose pierced because I sneeze so much. I'm just like, I don't know, I don't want to get like snot caught in my nose ring because I know that would happen to me. Wouldn't happen to anybody else, but it would happen to me. Let's get one of these little ticket embellishments. Oof. Yeah, I'm just not. I wanted so many tattoos growing up, but I'm just kind of like, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm not doing any of that no more. I have I have this tattoo and then I have um these stupid flowers behind my ankles that are that look terrible now. They never see the light of day though because I always wear socks. <laughs> they literally never see the light of day. Mm. Journaling spot here. 
knock in the door of you. Give thanks in all circumstances for this is God's will for you. That's cute. Hello, my own me too. Marty said the same exact thing about me and my horrible allergies. So, <laughs> trust me, I'm, uh, I'm. I always thought it was cool. Hang on, I just heard like a noise. Um, what was that noise? That was a weird noise. Anyways. I don't think, I'm trying to not to think about it. Anyways, I'm, it's too much of a snot face for that process, I think. Um, I think I'll just put this little butterfly faith journaling spot there. Your daughter got a tattoo. Cool. I'm going to have to cover this guy up because this is a prayer journal. <laughs> Uh, he's gonna, I don't know, he doesn't pass for Jesus, so I'll have to cover him up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he, he doesn't look like Jesus, and um, I'm not sure of his intentions. <laughs> So we'll definitely have to cover him up. With a Bible verse. <laughs> oh my God. Bible verse. Jesus said cover up. <laughs> Even though Jesus is like always naked. Or at least, okay, okay, when he was on the cross, right? They always paint him naked. I think I've seen more pictures of him like that naked than I have of him with clothes on. Um, okay. Yes, Jesus said be gone. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You guys. I didn't pick the right pages for this journal. I think sometimes I just make journals and then I make them fit the theme. In this case, that was a mistake. But we will make it right. <laughs> Hang on one second. Excuse me. Okay. There, he's decent now. <laughs> now that he's completely covered up, he looks great. <laughs> Just put this little miracle right here. Put this right here. I'm so excited about the envelopes I designed. They're so pretty. And they took a lot of work. Took a lot of my like little brain power to get it done. I'll show you guys in a minute. Let's see. Let's see. I'll put that little label there. Yeah, let me show you. But they look so pretty. So these envelopes coordinate with my um, past, my most recent, I'll say my recent um, fall printables. I have three sets of fall printables. And so I haven't printed the last set, but Here's the one set with the sunflowers. They look so nice. They have nice little phrases on them. 
beautiful fall clip art. And then here's the Halloween envelopes. These are so cute. Look how fun they are. Halloween envelopes. Again, they coordinate with the Halloween kit. The Halloween kit includes one envelope. But I decided why not make a whole set of envelopes because I was having so much fun with it. There's little eyeballs. Look at the Halloween ones. I love them. The witches in bed and breakfast. That one. This one's probably my favorite one. I love this one so much. I love it. Oh, this one's so beautiful <laughs> with the flowers. And last one. How fun with the little skulls on there. How cute is that? Um, and then the Christmas ones. Oh, the rose clip art. Same clip art from the sets. They match. I only made one extra set of envelopes. My brain was like. <laughs> but um, for now, there's only one set of the Christmas envelopes. Which, of course, matches those sets. Look how beautiful those flowers. Again, these bouquets, I set everything. I move. I put everything in place. Can't stress it enough. It was so much work. <laughs> it was so much work. So the holiday ones are gorgeous. You guys, I'm so excited. Again, these will be in the shop tonight. I'll go back to work on listing them after I go live here. But anyways, that is that. I have another set of... I didn't print out the other set of um, fall ones. I'm sure, what else did I miss? I think that's it. Just the other set of fall that I didn't print out. The purple one. The purple pastel fall. I'm so excited. They're so pretty. They're so beautiful. <laughs> the Halloween ones are really pretty. I don't have a lot of Halloween stuff. So that's going to be exciting to add. And uh, I'll keep working on other stuff as well. But also, I need to work on more Christmas stuff. I have a lot of Christmas stuff to do. Whew, I already feel like I'm late. Like, I already feel like Christmas is over. Daisy, just give up. <laughs> but this is, like, the first year that, like, I'm actually on time. I'm actually, like, early. So I'm like, okay, I've already got two Christmas kits done. If I don't get anything else done, that's more work than I've done in the last five years. So, <laughs> yeah, the candy cane ones came out real cute. All the roses. There's there two candy cane ones. This one. I love this one. This one's probably my favorite. It's so beautiful. I'm so happy I put in all that work for them because it just gives me such a unique look, you know? And I love that. I love that for me. <laughs> Let's see. Be there and could be a thing. And I think I'm gonna do a set and I'm just continuing on expanding on these kits. Or just in case you don't want to spend $17 and you just want a set of envelopes or a set of this or that, I'm working on it. I am working on it. I got frustrated using Photoshop. I'll get back to it eventually. Um, yeah, it can be uh, difficult, but not impossible. It just takes practice, just like with anything else. 
just takes practice. Okay, these ladies are uh, they're completely indecent. I guess she has a gun. She has a gun. Okay. Okay, Daisy, don't panic. I'm trying to <laughs> try to make a, I'm trying to make a prayer journal over here to pick a picture. Uh, first, it was a naked guy. Now it's a a scandally clad lady with a gun. Although I love it, it's so pretty. <sighs> Why did I pick that for this journal, though? It just likes that I have to cover it up. You know what I mean? Because it's such a good imagery. Oh, man. I don't know. She literally has a gun. And I was just doing basic. I do have my first TG in my Etsy. Ooh, how awesome. Um, what am I going to say? Miss Cheryl. I know my bad. I don't mean to be controversial. I really don't. <laughs> I don't even know how this happened. I'm trying to cover the whole thing up. Okay, there we go. I can cover it up. It's okay. I got a dollar store to do memo pad. <laughs> Honestly, I really only use basic things as well. Like, I, I really, I don't use anything fancy. Um, but, you know, you can do nice things with the basics. But I feel the same way, oh my God, about Illustrator. Oh God, I got to learn how to use it, but like. Illustrator frustrates me, for sure. Oh my god, Illustrator's a mess. <laughs> yeah, the guy was laid back. I mean, yeah, the other guy was laid back to compare to this lady holding a gun. Like I said, any other journal, that would have been fabulous, but not a prayer journal. Maybe not for the prayer journal. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't do that. <laughs> the Pope is going to call me and tell me not to do it. <laughs> it's my ADD brain. You know, I've just been using Photoshop for so long that sometimes, like, for me to teach someone else, what I was trying to show my husband how to do something, and I, I literally, I had almost like looked down at what I was doing to tell him what to do because it's, I just do it so instinctively now. Like I use all my little like uh, keys, you know what I mean? I don't go to the menu anymore. I just know which ones I'm going to do. And I have, I have it, <laughs> I have my own shortcuts set up and everything. And so when I was showing my husband, trying to show my husband how to do something, I had to look down at what I was doing. And <laughs> I had to remember, what, what did I just do to do that? Because I just kind of, just kind of do it now. It's almost like playing a piano to me. It's funny. It just takes practice, lady. It just takes practice. Let your face be bigger than you fear. Hang on, I have to make sure that I haven't used that yet because I might have and I can't remember. Which reminds me, I need to design more of these and I need to do Christmas ones. I need to do, oh, God, there's just so much to do, you guys. There's so much to do. And I'm so excited to get going. I need to make a junk journal, Miss Cheryl. You know, I watch people do things a lot before I do it myself. So just pretend you're doing research, just endless research. <laughs> That's a good, it's a good way to start. I know it's a very slow start, but like I said, I watch people do all 
something a lot before I dive in. And um, that's just how I work, and that's okay. Okay, we're just doing a quick flip through. Okay, I used the line version of it, but not the one with the quote. Okay. Okay, I gotta make sure I don't wanna repeat. I have enough to not repeat. You know, I also didn't do this one. Let's do this one instead. There you go, research is important. You gotta have research. Go. Next, I kind of, once I get my Etsy shop together, <laughs> I'm laughing because who knows when that'll happen. But once I get my Etsy shop together, <laughs> I can't even say that with a straight face. Once I get my Etsy shop together, <laughs> I want to um develop my other store. I have another store that's gonna be just for graphics and SVGs. I wanna make like mug images. Those are pretty hot right now, mugs and tumbler designs for sublimation. So I really want to get into that. Um because why not? I need that's my work, so I need to I need to work. <laughs> and and so I want to venture out to the world of SVGs. And it would be so much easier if I could just learn how to use Illustrator. But oh God, Illustrator. Oh my god. See to me, like it's like, oh just keep just learn it. But like but like it just seems like so much work. <laughs> but I found a way around it. I found a way to make it work with Photoshop. <laughs> so I can I can make it work with Photoshop and I don't have to I have to just learn some minimal things in Adobe Illustrator and it should work. It should work. Hi Miss Beverly, how are you? Okay, so that beautiful flower goes there, and then to love one another, to love another person, to see the face of God, there we go. What is going on, y'all? So I'm excited. I want to design mugs. Mugs is basically, you know, I could just continue on my junk journal style onto mugs, and so I'm excited. <laughs> I'm excited, but also, ugh, my current Etsy store. It's getting there. It's getting there. I'm I'm happy about how far I've come. <laughs> In my stinking little Etsy store. Still a lot to get done, but it's looking cute. It's looking cute. Just come together. I'm starting to get it to look like how I want it to look like. And if these product descriptions could just write themselves, that would be great. <laughs> Go. I want mug made saying put my sass in your craft. Can I ask why you went back to Etsy? Uh because I just I guess I wasn't as good as I thought I was at drawing my own audience. And so I figured I can go back on Etsy 
but I need to change things and how they are in my store. So, <laughs> we're, try <laughs> we're trying to make it work. Okay, on Etsy, but oh my god, am I unhappy every single time I see the total fees that I pay on Etsy. It's ridiculous. But I'm trying to make it work. I'm trying to change my business plan. <laughs> And I'm um, trying to make it work for myself, honestly. I just can't sell cheap printables anymore. I can't. Um, <laughs> it just doesn't work for me. <laughs> so I am um, trying to make more quality listings. Um, trying to make it work for myself and make it pay out as a business. This is not a hobby. This is my livelihood. <laughs> and I depend on it. So I need to charge um, what I need to charge to make a living wage. And uh, it's been working out. I'm happy. I'm happy. Um, and are you interested in making scrapbook digital papers and ephemera? Are you interested in making scrapbook digital, like twelve by like twelve by twelve digital papers? You mean like twelve by twelve? I haven't designed twelve by twelve papers in a long time. That could be something else I do. That I would. That's a good idea. Oh, I like that. I like that. I have not made twelve by twelve in a while. This would be so cute right here. It kind of covers up everything, though. But I do get this little heart situation. That's all it's being. Not, I mean, to use for cards, mini albums, etc. Um, But, like, you mean 12 by 12 paper. Like, just scrapbook pattern paper. Like, pattern paper? Is that what you're saying? trying to understand because I'm a little slow so I apologize. Explain to me like I'm two years old. <laughs> that would that would help. <laughs> Explain it to me as though they were the first words I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> oh my god. I'm it's not funny. like paper pad and digital format so like six by six 12 by 12 is usually the standard scrap of paper this one's not as wide it's literally a smidge less wide oh good goodness goodness me why no that's even wider hello Hello, nope. Nope. This is a little too small. Great. Great, great, great. Eight and a half by eleven. Oh, so you just mean patterned paper. Just patterned paper. Eight and a half digital. Okay. Okay. Good night, Miss Cheryl. I have patterned paper. Ish, I guess not really. <laughs> I guess I, I guess technically not. <laughs> so I could think about it. I could think about it. That's something to, to consider for reals. Okay. Oh, this is looking so cute. Okay. 
Ellen's over here. And I think I want some cereal. is my savior. We can put that right here. And I have a set of these ladies, um, but it has like um, a prayer ver Bible verse right here. And I'll be using them, I guess, in my next journal. <laughs> I didn't really plan this one out that well, I don't think. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Serve like Jesus, okay. I'm going to use the gingerbread kit to make a mini album Christmas in July. There you go. I hope you like it. I know you're the one that suggested I do it. And it's pretty cute. It's pretty freaking cute. <laughs> I'm going to try and make more pattern papers. I have to, I'm still a baby at making patterns. Um, I never practice it to say like, oh, I'm really good at it. So I need to um, practice more. However, the ones I made for my Christmas kit, I really like, so. I'm getting to a point where I like what I'm making. So it's just a matter of time. Just got to keep practicing. Just got to practice. I was able to manage to make a couple of nice looking patterns. Like I said, it's new to me. Making patterns is new. Miss Jen! See, like, this pattern, I made this pattern. So that one looks pretty good. And then this pattern, I made this pattern too. Not with the background, but the flower arrangement. What else? Oh, and this one too, I made this one. So I'm getting there. They're getting good. They're getting good. I just need still need practice. Just need to play around with it, practice, see what I like. Yes, I have new envelopes, Miss Jen. Well, I got to list them first. <laughs> I got to put them up for sale first, I suppose. I'll do that tonight. Tonight, tonight, tonight. Look good there, we're almost done. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. Candy cane ones are fun. Hi. 
How it was everybody's day. I was pretty much working on these envelopes the whole day, wasn't I? What else? I did manage to edit a couple of listings. My store is ridiculous, but I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I literally deleted 800 listings in the last couple of months. <laughs> 800 listings less. <laughs> I feel 700 pounds lighter. But that's where we are at right now. And it's going. It's going. It's going. It's going. I've made a lot of bundles. Um, I've bundled up so many listings. And um, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. And I'm a lot happier. Oh, my God. And I'm still going. I'm still, I still got a lot to combine. Condense, reduce, reuse. Okay. It's good, though. It feels good. That. Would look really pretty right there. I'm adding a lot of flowers, but but that's okay. Oh, you had a busy day, Miss Jen. My day was pretty chill. <laughs> pretty chill, I suppose. Yeah, it was just getting to be too many listings in my shop. <laughs> just too many. Just too, too many. Cool. I'm still going, girl. I'm still going. There's still more to delete. Delete, delete, delete. But I'm not really deleting them. I'm just, I'm literally just condensing my listings. But it feels good. It feels really good. It's for the better. It's for the better. Oh, you went swimming? Nice. Nice. I'm so picky about where I go swimming. <laughs> that I don't go swimming. That's how picky I go. Unless it's somebody's private pool. The fear just kind of takes over. I'm not like a germaphobe that much. <laughs> Looking at my house, you would not think I'm a germaphobe. <laughs> but I am picky about pools. I don't know. I'm weird. Oh, my HOA has a pool too, but. It's a cesspool. <laughs> I would not go in there. I would not go in there. This is not a fancy place. <laughs> this is not a fancy place. Ours is supposed to be exclusive too, but like I always see hobos in there. So it's just like, I just don't go in there anymore ever since I've seen a couple of them showering in there. I mean, good for them. <laughs> I guess I'd rather them shower in that pool than not shower at all. But it's just like, I just don't want to go in there. <laughs> myself <laughs> be faithful in small things because it is in them that your strength lies 
Yeah, my HOA is like an expensive car payment. Mine is ridiculous. My HOA charges, I think we pay like 250, dude. We pay like 250. And I don't I don't live anywhere fancy. So I'm really upset about it. You should not be charging that much for where I live. 250. That's a lot. That is a lot. It's too much. It's ridiculous. Yours is way more, but you live somewhere fancy. <laughs> I, live, I, live, I live in the gutters. <laughs> Should be way less <laughs> for where I live. Oh, this little, this little shoe. I don't know. I like the little shoe. I'm going to put the little shoe right here. We don't even have grass, dude. Like, crap. <laughs> no, I guess we do, technically. We do have a little grass. Like, supposed to be like a park, but I don't have a dog. And I'm not a hobo, so I don't hang out there. <laughs> I live in a high end modular park. Fancy. All double wides with two garage. Ooh. Boo -boo. Daisy Boo Boo says he doesn't live in the gutter. He eats fancy feast. Oh, that boy is real fancy. That boy is a real fancy boy. He really is. <laughs> he's the fanciest boy. Oh my god, he spent the whole day um, sleeping in bed with my husband while my husband was taking his nap. That boy was so happy snuggling and just being the best little boy. Just And then when he wasn't snuggling, he was sitting at the corner of the bed. <laughs> it was so cute. It was so cute. I loved it. I love seeing him. Because my husband, I, my husband is his favorite, I think, if you ask me. He always wants to snuggle up with my husband. He'll come say hi to me once in a while, but he always snuggles with me. But also, I'm a very heavy sleeper, and I move around a lot, so he doesn't like that. <laughs> Miss Letitia. Hi, Miss Letitia. So I move around a lot, and I'm a very heavy sleeper, so he doesn't really like to, like, snuggle up with me. <laughs> I, I would get uncomfortable real quick. Real quick. Ooh, we're almost there. We're almost there. Yes, we're almost there. Then I gotta put stuff in pockets. And I still have to make a dangle for this. Oh my goodness. I know tomorrow's Saturday, but I might come on live to make the dangle for this. Maybe. So after the dangle, then it's done. And I always like making dangles on my, on my life. It's always fun. Okay, there we go. That goes there. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see what else we got. Rise up and pray would be pretty right here. This little handkerchief pocket. It's really hard for me to cut up black olives and eat them. I don't think I'm an olive fan. <sighs> I've certainly never just ate an olive. Sometimes they were on a pizza that I didn't order. <laughs> Seems like an odd thing, an olive, just really odd to me. <laughs> Did I do one of these? This would be kind of crazy with the colors here, but 
but also it would might be okay. No, let's just go with one of these. Okay. Just making some notepads here. There, and now we're going to find something that glue on top. Okay, that and then I'm going to put. This yellow flower would be pretty, it would be complimentary. That would be nice too, though. I kind of like this better. It goes with the yellow, I like it. Let's do that. Do I want cereal or do I want tuna? <laughs> now I'm thinking tuna on crackers sounds really good too. What do I want? Savory or sweet? I guess maybe the tuna sounds better. Tuna does sound better. The one with the yellow. Do you get boo boo the can juice? No, I don't. Should I? No, I don't. <laughs> I don't. I never thought about that. I never thought about that ever in my life. No, I just throw it into the sink. <laughs> That's a thing? Is that a thing? I didn't know that was a thing. I had no idea. No, I don't. He might get excited, though, because I haven't given him canned food in a minute. We're going to go get him some tomorrow. But he might go a little crazy when I open my can of tuna. Because he's going to think it's his wet food. <laughs> they love the tuna juice, and it's good for his coat. Interesting. I never heard of that. I had never, ever heard of that. That is most interesting. Most of the interestings. Mm. Interesting. So God is my first priority is cute. Ooh, why do my legs hurt? My legs feel like they're they've been hanging or something. My legs feel a little sore. That's not good. Okay. I gotta put something over here. This yellow butterfly thing. Link spot over here. There we go.
go. Thank you, Miss Letitia. We are getting there. Okay. I think one of Steph's cat, she calls the big one. The big one. That's funny. Currently having a flare. Pain is ridiculous. Oh no. That's not good. I'm sorry, Beverly. little banner I have one that goes the right way oh, but I kind of put one over it. no no I don't want to do that nope 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 chamber right let's just go with the stamp regular little stamp What's up, Boogaloo Bush? <laughs> He's so silly. He's just watching me. Okay, put this down here. And I'm going to put something over here. I might just put a little label. here but I can't block this bird oh my it's got kind of difficult I want to block that bird oh no I guess I could go I could go this way okay that could be a good thing I could do Firework, you got fireworks already? <laughs> I guess I gotta prepare myself for that. Because around my neighborhood, I hear pop, pop, I duck. 
<laughs> so I gotta remember. I gotta remember not to flinch. <laughs> but you do hear guns out here too at the same time. It's not cool, you guys. It's not cool. It freaks me out. <laughs> has arthritis in her hand and a swelling cramp that she can't create sometimes so when I say prayers I can't eat. oh no that's why I've been trying to pace myself okay Last page, oh my god, last page. How exciting, how exciting. All right. Last page, officially, okay, oh yeah. All right, let's see if I can stuff the pockets before I walk off. Um, I'm trying to move stuff around on my desk. That container. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm trying to grab. What else do I have? Like pockets. What else do I have? Non prayer stuff in there as well. Oops, oops, oops. Oops, 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 oops. My desk is uh, officially no mess. Okay, so we got that, 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 that. I have some of my journal cards. I have other things behind me as well I'm grabbing on. Um, okay, so we have this here pocket first. And then I, should I, I should have pulled these apart first before I try and use them. I'm going to rip them. Here I have one of my pink prayer postcards. I'll put that in there. As well as a prayer jar because it's big enough. <laughs> Just because it's big enough. What should I have done? I should have done something here because it's kind of kind of ugly. Hang on. Hang on, I can fix this maybe. Possibly. Possibly. With this butterfly, <laughs> make it all pretty. <laughs> ah, here's my clip. Oh, thank you, Miss Jenny. The pink fabric. I love that pink fabric so much as well. It's so pretty. And you're right, it does go with a lot. It goes with a lot. It's very neutral. Come on, glue. It's the last thing I need glue. Help me. Help me. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't see this page before. This journal has a lot of pages that I apparently did not plan out to be for a prayer journal. Apparently. I didn't plan this out, so we'll just cover that up here. <laughs> cover this up here. Like it never happened. Okay. We'll be all right. <laughs> we will be all right. I need to get my little paper clip moment. Uh, that's one thing I have not replenished is my 
paperclip stash. It's very, very low right now. But uh, we can make it work. Got a paper clip here. And let's see, I do have some genuine prayer journal type of ephemera. This is for Mother's Day. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at this. It's actually a card for Mother. It says on Mother's Day. That one's so pretty. So I'm going to go right there. And we'll turn the page. And put one of these pretty flower cards back here. Got this little pocket here. We can put be still I know that I'm your god. I usually put two things per pocket. Um, let's see. Oh, but this is kind of small. Okay, I just understood. I just I just understood that this is small. Okay. So we have this uh, little postcard of this little angel. I can go in there. We got this little pocket, and I got little. Oops, I just touched one of my lamps. <laughs> that little tag for that little pocket. We also have little jars with little sentiments. This one says, the Lord gives wisdom. Again, if y'all want to check out my prayer, Dark Journal Printables, there's a link. Everything that I'm using is from my store. Okay, so we have this little tuck spot that we can put something on. I have these library cards. Like these beautiful vintage crosses. Oops, that was my elbow. <laughs> that was my elbow. Okay. <laughs> Why didn't I use this again? I should have checked. I should have checked. I like some the same things and I tend to use them so I need to check myself <laughs> to make sure I didn't use them 10 times over because that'll happen to me. I get excited. Okay, I get excited about things. Okay, let's get this over here. So let's see what this is. Okay. So that will go there. We need another paper clip. I use this fun like quote symbol. I don't know. <laughs> it's like a little quote symbol. Put more flower cards right there. And we'll put this little prayer card right there. Okay, and on this other side, what else do we got? What else do we got? Yeah, speech bubble, speech bubble. That's what it is. Ah, we got these bingo cards. Gotta go there. Got a pocket, so we'll put a journal card, one of these back here. I'll also put one of these date cards right here. Okay. I should have put something here too. This is, this is unacceptable. <laughs> and I'm reaching over for something. <laughs> no, see, that's not going to work. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. So we'll just have to cover it because I don't like it. And that happens sometimes. For this one, I'm going to use a glue stick because the book paper is kind of shiny. 
And I've learned my lesson now. I don't, I'm not going to make any more journals with shiny pages. Because it, the glue I like doesn't stick to it very well. Is this not going to stick either? This should stick. Should stick. If it doesn't stick, I'm going to freak out. Where's my glue? There it is. Sorry, y'all. We're having a miss a malfunction over here. There we go. Cover that up. There we go, that's better. That's better. How you got white Elmer's glue stick? Um, hang on, I'll show you what it is in a minute. I get it from Amazon. Hang on. Hang on. Yeah, Amazon. I buy my knit on Amazon. Okay, hang on. Just because I'm full of glue. Okay, so my glue stick. Elmar's Extra Strength Glue Stick. I buy them in a box of like 24. I think it's like $10. Okay, see that is much better. Much better. Much better. Okay. Let's keep going. We're looking for pockets. Here's a pocket right here. We'll put one of these pretty ephemeras right there. Also, I think we can fit one of these there. No, it's not going to fit. No. <laughs> I'm not going to fit, so we'll put one of these. Yeah, that'll fit. Okay. Got another spot for paper clip. Let's put a postcard right here. One of my prayer postcards. On this other side. I'll put this lady. She seems nice. And then, and then, and then, be the light right here. And I'll add another journaling big jar here. Why not? Okay, we got a little spot right here. And then we got this right here. And here. This fit this little line journal card will fit. And then also we'll put this one in there as well. There we go. Oop, so we got a paper clip over here. Now we can put one of these envelopes. And we'll put this card in there. Why not? Why not? Why shouldn't I? <laughs> okay, and we got another spot for something over here. And we'll put one of these library cards, as well as a tag. We'll pick one at random. My God meets all my needs. We'll put that there as well. Pink, blue, and purple prayer journal. <clears throat> yeah, I find it really hard to stick to the theme. <laughs> uh, but I can work on it. I can work on it. <laughs> Let's see. I'm looking for a tag. 
That'll fit this. Oof. Oof. That's not going to fit. That is not going to fit. Okay, this one. This one will fit right here. i got to make more of these, too. It's been a minute since I've made those. That'll go right there. That'll go great. Okay. This little card in here, along with, along with what? I got this, this postcard will fit. There we go. Another post, another clip, I should say. I was going to say post it, but that doesn't make sense. <laughs> that wouldn't make any sense. Okay, so, oh yeah, I got a stamp too. I got a stamp. Thanks for reminding me of that. I do need to do that. <laughs> My stamps over there probably literally melting. Literally, you know how those stamps melt. <laughs> probably... Melting as we speak right now. <laughs> Don't tell my husband that stamps melt. <laughs> or I'll get in trouble <laughs> for buying so many dang stamps. <laughs> gotta go there, gotta go there. We got another poke. Why do I want to keep saying post it? We got another paperclip moment. Stop saying post it, Daisy. Because it's not a freaking post it. <laughs> put that there. And we'll put, we'll just put a regular pink postcard right here. We got a pocket. We got a pocket. Pocket alert. Pocket alert. <laughs> We got a pocket, people. We got a pocket. What am I going to put here? Another one of these. Why not? And then one of these button cards. Here. We're looking for pockets. We're looking for pockets. We're looking for tucks. Here's more pockets. Got this. And we got another tag. And we got another library card. Right there. Oh, we got a pocket. Got a pocket. We got a pocket. Ooh, I need to print out more ephemera. I really do. Print out more stuff. There's another lined card. Okay, we have another have another text box. Oh, okay, I'm going to put another one of my note cards because I love those. I don't love them. And then I'll put this postcard. Wait, there's a postcard with a butterfly. That's what I want. Check your pile of prints, right? Here is a butterfly. I'm put that there. Ooh, another spot for paper clips. I said it correctly this time. I am almost out of paper clips. That's crazy. That is crazy. I, ha I need to um, actually cut out a lot of ephemera I have printed. I have kind of um, delayed doing that and I really need to do it now. Because <laughs> I'm looking at all my stuff and all I have is like 
<laughs> I have freaking postcards. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. That is it. This journal is done. Tomorrow I'm going to come back. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to come live during the day. I'm going to make a dangle for this one because it doesn't have a dangle. And then I can probably get this posted to my store by Monday and do a flip through by Monday. Yeah, I think that's what's going to happen. I'm going to do flip through one by one, one at a time before I would normally like wait till I have them all done. But I'm going to do one at a time. So that's it. Okay, we're all done with this journal. All right, so everybody have a good night. We will reconvene sometime tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, come check me out. Okay, everybody have a good day, and I'll see y'all. Have a good night. Bye.